Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. So I have been shopping recently. A lot of you will know this if you've watched my previous videos. I've been shopping for spring jackets. I have found that a lot of my jackets are a little bit big for me. They're kind of swamping me. They're a bit big on the shoulders and I did need to size down as much as I love an oversized jacket look. They were just a little bit too oversized, which is such a shame, but I put my ones that I love into storage because I'm sure, well, they are so timeless, but I'm sure at some point in my life, I will want maybe a wider shoulder again and they will fit me once again so they are in storage and I've picked up some more lovely spring jackets to try on with you there's also a couple that I'll throw in at the end which aren't part of this order but I've ordered and I love the majority of this order is blazers but I have like a nice dust a trench at the end of this if you haven't seen it in my other videos which i'm absolutely loving so i will show you that as well because i'm really really pleased with it i've also ordered a lovely trench from mango in a different color as well which i am very excited for it to arrive but it's not arriving until tuesday but if i can and it does arrive i'll pop a little bit in at the end along with the other duster as well so if you want to see some lovely spring blazers that i picked up from zara then keep on watching what is this why am i doing this so some of these items are actually part of a cold which i couldn't resist picking up the bottoms too if it came as a cohort so I will show you the full look first up we have this gorgeous you will have seen this if you watched my what I wore in a week which I will link at the top of the screen and in the info box but it's this lovely beige blazer trouser cohort set it is so beautiful it's kind of like a linen look but it's like a polyester viscose mix it's really nice really light the material just lends itself to looking very casual i got the blazer in a small and i believe the trousers in an extra small but i will confirm there we go the length of them is really good they're meant to be like crops but they have this like rolled up look to them can you see that so what i've just done is when i wear them i roll them up another turn and it kind of just looks pretty much exactly the same i will wonder where this though just so it has a little bit more kind of stick and stays that way but i wore these yesterday and they stayed up fine and they were really lovely and comfy yes i did forget to take the tag out when i wore them yesterday but i will be keeping them sometimes i actually put things through the wash with the tags in it's messy i need to remember to just take them out but yeah the blazer itself is gorgeous i wasn't sure i was gonna love this beige tone i have to admit i'm a little bit over the kind of like all brown everything phase that has really like graced us over the past couple of years but i do think this is such a classic such a staple to have in your wardrobe and this blazer especially i thought would look so cool with like blue denim shorts in the summer i think it's got real like seasonal longevity in my wardrobe wardrobe and I love that and it fits really well as well it does have a little bit of like an oversizedness still to it but it really adds to the relaxed feel that it has which I like but it's just not too crazy oversized on my shoulders like it has a little bit of padding but fits well on my shoulders so I'm very very happy with it so I'll show you guys what that looks like on now so this blazer cold set I just love the trousers actually fit really well i'm very happy with these they look really cute on their own in addition to with the jacket on which i really like they're a nice comfy pair that i can wear around the house but i can also wear with the jacket if i wanted to look smarter so these two are a really great little duo and i've just paired them with my beige trainers even though i wasn't so keen on the all beige everything kind of look i do think that this blazer would work really beautifully with a pair of like blue denim shorts underneath or even black denim shorts on warmer days and i do think that this color does kind of lend itself well to the summer oh the sun's come out for it as well that's lovely i think in terms of a bag this works really nicely with the tones of the outfit this would be a great one for me to wear to london if i'm just like not going to think too much about my outfit if i want to be comfy the look smart and this bag works perfectly in with that and then it's also like a nice big tote bag as well that i love using in the summer so i've just worn a black zara body underneath which is really nice you could also go white as well which i think looks really cute too so i'm going to show you this look now without the trousers but with a pair of shorts just so i can show you kind of how i wear this for summer the sun has come out for this blazer and shorts combo oh no it's gone it's gone i'm so sad so this is what the blazer looks like with the shorts i love it i think this tone works so beautifully being more of a cool toned beige it works really nicely with the blue tones of the shorts for summer i really want like a black body blue denim shorts and trainers to be a real go-to for me i think it will save so much time when getting ready and in the past if i've gone for something like this i would have gone for a leather jacket over the top but it's just feeling a bit too boxy i can't really put my finger on exactly what it is but i'm just finding they really don't suit me at the moment and i think this is the perfect alternative i love this tone especially with blue instead of like the 
beige on the bottom don't get me wrong i love it as a cord but i love this even more when it's paired with really summery items i just love it 10 times more the sun is back oh, i'm feeling the summer vibes if the weather could just cooperate in terms of temperature that would be amazing the bag that i showed you earlier works really nicely with this look as well so i think just for really hot days when i'm kind of like walking around brighton and when i say really hot i mean like warm but you still need a jacket this would be such a nice go-to it's really nice as well because it's not a black blazer which i probably wear on more of a cooler less sunny day this isn't going to attract the heat in the same way you're not going to feel like you're absolutely baking in this but it is thick enough to keep you warm if there is a little bit of a breeze and i love that i just love the way this looks with the big denim shorts also i know i originally wanted a white blazer to pair with shorts i actually think this blazer is a hundred times better because it's not that like real stark contrast like when you wear white with something it's a real contrast whereas this is just such a more subtle tone and a more natural tone i think it actually works way better when i'm pairing it with like a black top blue denim that kind of thing it's just not the statement part of the outfit you know it's like tying it all in nicely without taking over and that's i think what i really really love about this my vision is complete and it also comes in a khaki color which i haven't tried on yet but i'm really excited about i definitely think this is much more of a smart almost more formal color it reminds me of like something that you'd see like dad's wearing in like us sitcoms in like the 80s but yeah i think it's cool i do wish the trousers had belt loops because i think that these trousers would look especially cool and almost like especially 80s if you threw a brown belt on around the waist with them i'm excited to try this on and see how it looks but i do think even if the full cord just feels a bit much on me especially now that my hair is darker it might just look a bit too i don't know i don't know what the word is just like a bit too dark you know like it might kind of like drag me down a little bit i do think that this color blazer with like a lovely white or black pair of shorts in the summer would look lovely like all of these blazers will go so well with shorts in the summer so next we have the green cord i really like this <laughs> the dog is upstaging me at all times i really like this i do have concerns that it's maybe a bit more of an autumnal look than it is for spring but i do think during the summer if i wanted to wear a blazer trouser combo and i wore this with like black heels it could be like a nice summer suit kind of cohort i actually think this would dress up really well with a pair of heels and chunky bold accessories that kind of vibe i think it would look really cute and maybe also with black shorts in the summer the khaki blazer would look really cute as well my only thing with this is that the blazer is just a little bit long it feels a tiny bit long on me but i think if you're taller than me for reference five foot two if i haven't said that already in this video if you're taller than me this will be a really nice long line blazer and the trousers will also not need rolling up which is also gold but i do think this one looks really cool especially with my trainers i really love the khaki look and i like how it works now that my hair is a little bit darker as well i think it's a really nice color on me but like i said i just can't decide if it's like appropriate for this time of year but i think on the whole it fits really well and i'm really happy with it i'm so in need of a jacket like that that i can just throw on and that's something i've definitely been missing over the past month is just a really great staple jacket in my wardrobe that i can pretty much throw on over anything whether it's leggings jeans black trousers i feel like a blazer works well across all of those especially a black blazer which i will get to later in this video but before then i still have another cold and i'm so obsessed with this this could be a love it or hate it kind of vibe is this gonna make my camera go funny who knows it's another cohort so we have these little stripy shorts which i just think are so cute for the summertime so cute i got these in a small because they have belt loops so even if they're a little bit big on me i can belt them and cinch them in so it's not really an issue but yeah these are so cute almost like beachy but like smart beachy so i feel like you could get away with wearing these in a number of different situations whether alone or with the blazer which does look quite smart but i think the striping and the shorts kind of combined with it can casual it down especially if you roll up the sleeves as well i always feel like that really really helps and obviously have it open this with a little white bralette in summer oh it's just gonna be absolutely everything it's so cute i can't wait to try it on i'm really hoping that it looks good on me and i don't look absolutely ridiculous and like i should be going to like a private school you know where they have the little the cute little straw hats so do tell me if i just look like i should be wearing a cute little straw hat and carrying a lunchbox because it's not the vibe so this little cold set i think is really cute i'm kind of on the fence a little bit i'm just not sure i think i'm kind of like second guessing myself a little bit but i think it's really cute i love the little blue pinstripe i just think it's really sweet i throw my trainers 
clothes on with this but you could go for like a white sandal i think that would be really sweet for days where i want to be a little bit more dressy i think this would also look really cute with like an updo like a really simple ponytail or something like that as well I'd probably go for my little yellow bag with this one just to contrast the blue stripes i think that would be really lovely and then potentially a brown belt around the middle as well i wasn't really sure i didn't know again if that made it a bit too like preppy i'd love your thoughts on that but the yellow bag is a definite and i really like the way trainers casuals this look down a little bit yeah i think it fits well it's not like fitted the shoulder pads are coming off my shoulder ever so slightly but i think it gives like a nice drop to the arms nothing crazy like some of the other jackets in this video you could also go for a white body under this as well which i think would make it look way more summery very cute and like playful yeah i'd love to know what you think do you rate it do you hate it let me know in the comments next up we have a black long line blazer i'm gonna say this is single breasted it's got a little bit of padding on the shoulders it looks like it's gonna be a good length but sometimes i can't tell until i've got these on this is the longer of the two black blazers i picked up i thought i'd pick up one that's shorter just to see what it's like with like various trousers and things like that but i think a black long blazer always works so well if you're wearing leggings or something skinny on the bottom this one seems to have pockets i'm not sure if they're fake pockets because zara does have a real habit of doing that i know people say you can like peel away the stitching but there's actually like no pocket beneath some of them so you don't always know but yeah i got this in a size extra small it was 50 pounds the quality feels really nice actually it's a really nice material it's not too rough like sometimes you get a black blazer and they're a bit like textured and quite rough i feel like it's when it's like cotton but it's not been like brushed in any way but i don't think this is cotton this is viscose polyester and a last rain so we'll see how i get on with this one it's like fairly thick so i think it will keep me nice and warm this is definitely not a summer vibe really but a perfect one for like spring and autumn and under an another coat potentially in the winter so i think this is going to be a nice staple piece in my wardrobe fingers crossed it fits okay so the black blazer in the oversized small is an absolute winner for me i'm actually filming these cutaways a few days later and i wore this out over the weekend and it works treat i just had a couple of thin layers underneath and it's just perfect for the weather this time of year it's not too thick and heavy but it's definitely not too light it is an oversized fit so there's still quite a bit of room in there but when i do the button up here like i feel like it's the perfect kind of fit like not too tight but not too loose either my other one in a small was a very very similar fit to this i just like tried them on to compare materials are very similar but just a little bit different and the other one has like real pockets but the small one definitely had a lot of extra material here and it stuck out a lot further on the shoulders as well and just really swamped me so this one is a much better oversized blazer fit i love it i wore it with leggings and trainers at the weekend and it was so cute but today i just paired it with my zara mom jeans and i'll try and link these and figure out which color i got them in as well and I'll pop that in the info box because I was trying to find these in black the other day and I was actually struggling. There are way too many pairs of jeans on Zara. And then for trainers, I've got my major trainers, which I just love. I think this works so nicely with a black blazer and just really like casuals it down. And then have a very similar one in a creamy kind of e-crew color. This one actually has a slightly more rough texture to it than the other one, which is funny because it's made out of all the same stuff as the last one. But yeah, it's very similar in its style. This one's actually more expensive. It's 79 99 and it does look like it's slightly longer so we will see it might be a bit too long i don't want to go for blazers that are too crazy long and then they just kind of could be dresses on me because that's not the vibe i'm going for especially if i want to wear like a white blazer with like white trousers and the white blazer is just way too long it's going to be really awkward so this jacket i didn't think i was going to like as much as i do i'm actually really happy with how it fits i think it looks really nice i'm going to also try it with a pair of blue jeans just to kind of show you something a little bit more casual but i think this one works really nicely both not only being dressy but casual as well i originally thought this was going to be more of a one or the other kind of blazer but i do actually think it will work really well in more of a casual format as well as really dressing it up as well it does have a little bit of an 80s vibe but not as badly as i thought it was going to i actually think it's really cute i paired it with my little split hem trousers and my major trainers just to give it like a dressed up but casual vibe and then i've just paired it with my ysl bag just because i wanted to throw a beige tone in here and show you what the e-crew looks like against like a beige tone sometimes i find these kind of off-white colors really really difficult to style but this one's actually not too bad at all if in doubt just don't pair it with anything white because it really shows that it's like an off white color but i actually really like it it fits really well i can't tell if i'm just going to love everything because everything's going to be fitting better than the things i already own my old e-crew blazer definitely doesn't fit 
this well. So this one is so cute in comparison. And this is what the Ecru blazer looks like with the blue jeans. I actually think blue jeans really bring out the yellow tones in the Ecru. I don't know if that will show up on camera. I don't know if everyone else agrees with me, but this is my preferred way to wear it. I definitely prefer black on the bottom just to cinch in the silhouette somewhere because otherwise this look is looking very big and oversized. Like the jacket is a lighter color, so it's gonna look a little bit more oversized than the black jacket, for example. So yeah, this isn't my preferred way of styling, but I just wanted to give you an idea of what it looks like in case you are a blue jeans and a blazer kind of person. So I picked up another one. This one has like the kind of double black buttons on it. It looks a little bit smarter because of that. I'm not sure. I just don't know if the white blazers are gonna be the ones, but I'm gonna give them a go anyway because I really would like to have a cute white blazer to just pair with like leggings, black skinny jeans, that kind of thing. I picked this one up in a small and it was 49. 99. So the white blazer I love, but sadly it is just a little bit too big for me. It sticks so far off the shoulder in terms of like the shoulder pads. It sticks about a centimeter off of my shoulder. It just looks a bit bulky and it's quite a chunky shoulder pad as well, which is annoying. Some of the others are just like a little bit more subtle. Let's go with subtle, which is a little bit sad, but hopefully getting an extra small should at least sort out the kind of issue of the shoulders being a little bit too wide. I've just paired it with some leggings and my trainers to show you guys. I did really want to show you with a pair of denim shorts underneath, like that is one of the ways I'm so excited to style my blazers this summer, but because it is just so oversized, the look just didn't look right. But I know once I get a white blazer that is like really beautifully fitted, even if still oversized, like at least it just fits my kind of shoulders properly. I think it'll be a really cute look, but I need the right fit first. But yeah, I really like the white tone of it. It's like a true white, which I'm really happy with. It's good to know which blazers on Zara are a true white because sometimes you just don't know until you get them and something says it's white, but it's not white. But I can confirm this is an actual white and I really like it, it's cute. And then finally we have a shorter black blazer, which I think will work well if I'm wearing like a black skinny trouser, which I know is a very specific look. However, I do wear my Topshop black cigarette trousers all the time. So this could be a good one to pair with it. Maybe a bit too smart for my kind of vibe. I thought I'd give it a go anyway, just because I'm really struggling with what to pair with my black cigarette trousers that's not like a very long either knitted coat or like a duster coat or something like that because I used to always wear black leather jackets and I put my black leather jackets on now and I'm just like this doesn't work with me anymore and it's so strange because a black leather jacket used to be a real go-to for me but again they all either feel too long or too boxy or a bit like this one ping me but ultimately they just feel very I think maybe once my hair is a little bit longer and I can style it in a more soft way maybe it will work but at the moment it's all just a bit too harsh so that's also something that I've really been struggling with as well I think it's why my style has kind of like shifted a little bit over the past I would say kind of like eight months I think my wardrobe's had to soften slightly because obviously my hair is like shorter and darker and I wear it straight more because the curls are just very if I curl my hair when it's like this length it's very very poofy which kind of works really beautifully if I'm wearing like a summer dress or something like that but other than that, I'm just a bit like, this is this is too much for me. So yeah, that might not work with the cigarette trousers. It might be a bit too smart a vibe, but we will see. I thought I'd try it anyway because I'm in a real state of like flux at the moment. So this blazer fits so nicely. I'm very happy with this one. It is more of a formal structure. I feel like the fact that it's shorter and just slightly more fitted and the way it's like stitched together, it's got a bit more shape to it. It's a bit less boxy than a lot of the other jackets in this haul. But it works so well with my black trousers which are just my go-to for more formal occasions where I'm just not sure what to wear. And I just think that these two with a black body underneath and then a real kind of cute statement pair of shoes, like some fun chunky jewellery, it really like makes the look, but these are just like a great go-to for me to have in my wardrobe. A black fitted jacket is an essential for when you're just like not really feeling like overthinking your outfit. I think it's a good length for me as well. I wouldn't really want anything shorter than this. I don't think that would be overly flattering on my body type, but I think it all depends on your shape and each individual person but this feels like a good fit for me so those are the jackets let me know which ones your favorites are i will kind of like let you know as i try them on which ones i will keep and return in addition to those pieces i'll also show you the kind of dustery trenches now as well so just in case you haven't seen it this is the little black trench that I got from H&M. I love this. In the past, I have always gone to buy black trenches or duster coats. I actually don't think I've ever like owned one. I don't remember ever owning like one like proper like dustery kind of trench coat. I've obviously got 
many black coats, but I always felt like a black trench was a little bit of a cop out. It just wasn't interesting enough. It wasn't worth purchasing, but I was so wrong. It is an absolute gem in my wardrobe right now for my spring wardrobe. I love wearing like a black body with my blue jeans, my major trainers, just like a real go-to for me, a really easy, simple uniform. And I can then throw this over the top. It's just so cute. It's very lightweight. It's not chunky, so I don't feel like it's really like bulking me out, which is a really refreshing feel after so many heavy coats over the winter. I definitely am a coatigan or trench coat kind of girl. I just love how light they are. And because I don't like anything too chunky, I was wearing a lot of like wrap coats, waterfall kind of coats, that kind of nice and snuggly, it has a tie waist kind of look over the winter I wore that so much and we're getting to a point in the year where that now feels really inappropriate to be wearing that but it's a silhouette that I love and I like a lighter coat I don't like to feel too bulky so this is just the perfect addition to my wardrobe this is the spring summer version of my winter coats and it has just been an absolute gem to have in my wardrobe so far I think I'll still get so much wear out of it as I start wearing shorts and shorter items in the summer I will literally switch these jeans out for a pair of blue shorts and keep the look going but I think this will still look really cool if I've got shorts on underneath and I'll just obviously like leave it open. It looks really good with a pair of black tailored trousers as well, really nice and smart but still casual with my trainers but I've just shown you it with my blue jeans today because number one it is obviously a go-to for me but number two you can kind of see the coat a bit more because it's contrasted with the denim but yeah I just absolutely love it, it looks really cute tied up as well which I also wear it like this more if I'm wearing like leggings underneath or an all black outfit I tend to wear it like this a bit more I don't love my jeans poking out under it when I tie it up you're gonna see me wearing this a lot over the coming months and I'm so sorry but I'm so happy with it I think I've learned my lesson I need to stop going for interesting colors and just start opting for black I'm so much more happy and more comfortable in a black outfit with just like a little bit of denim in there it makes my soul so happy lesson learned but yeah that is everything let me know which were your faves in the comments I really hope you guys have enjoyed today's video let me know if you like the kind of like shopping for specific items with me because it's something that I normally do in private and I just kind of show you later down the line that I've like picked up like a jacket or a pair of jeans or if you haven't seen my shopping for jeans video I will link that as well but yeah let me know if specific items are helpful to you I would love to know but I hope you're all having a lovely day and I will see you guys again very very soon love you bye